Good morning, Pablo. It's Monday, November 3rd. Now, I don't know about you, but today has been a pretty stressful day for me, and I have gone to a counselor to see if I can get some classes switched around. Hopefully everything works out, and I'll keep you updated. I just realized that those clips are really shaky. I think it's because I talk with my hands. Anyway, Pablo, you might notice that we are, in fact, in my dorm room. We're just at a completely different angle. That right there is my desk where I usually do this. However, I had to move my lamp from my desk to my piano, which is currently sitting here. We just went through a whole system of rearranging the room. We switched the beds around, we moved the desk, we put the piano over here in the corner instead, and it gives us a lot more space to do all the things that we need to do. As I said, today has been a pretty stressful day. And quite honestly, one cure to stress is popsicles. Popsicles are wonderful. Mm. Pablo, my two biggest stress relievers are popsicles and music. I might switch the order of those two. I don't really know yet. So I ended up finally figuring out my schedule, and it just so happens that even though math is a required course at Millican University, I took music theory, which is a substitute for a math credit. Who knew? That being said, I still have to take a lot of gen eds, including a science course with a lab, two semesters of a US history course, and three semesters of a language. I also have to take a public speaking course, which, quite honestly, I don't think I will struggle too much with, and I have to take a global studies course. I dropped my popsicle! Saved it. This is the saddest sight in the world. Pablo, other than scheduling things, my classes are going pretty well, in choir, we're learning all kinds of new music because we have some upcoming concerts. We have an event called Vespers going on in early December where over 300 singers combine together to form a huge choir. And for the past 55 years, there have been 7,000 plus people there to watch us. Now, I don't know about you, but I think that's one of the biggest audiences I've ever had. Although there was that one time I sang the national anthem at Wrigley Field. Speaking of which, I have recently realized how fortunate I am to have all of the opportunity that I've had in the past few years. And I think that that is mostly due to my parents. So definitely today, a shout out to them. They are amazing, for lack of a better word. Another thing that I've realized is, Pablo, these videos are getting kind of dreary. And I don't know why. So I think we should figure out something to make it a little more fun. Like, perhaps, adding a clip like this. Number 23. What do you drink with dinner? Blood. <laughs> <laughs> to every video. Hopefully our audience isn't getting too bored, but Pablo, I think that's it for me for today. So Pablo, I'll see you tomorrow. What do you drink with dinner? Blood. <laughs>